Hey, welcome back to the next tutorial in our series. In this video, we will be discussing how to integrate Google Cloud services into the Housey app, which is essential for enabling features like Google Maps, Places API and Play Integrity. So when you create a Firebase project, a corresponding Google Cloud project is automatically created. This Google Cloud project serves as the underlying infrastructure for your Firebase project allowing you to use various Google Cloud services such as Maps, Places API, Play Integrity and more alongside Firebase. Now let's head over to the Google Cloud console to manage your project. Go to console.google.cloud.com Once you are there, click the project drop down in the top left corner and select your project or search for it if it does not appear in the list. The next step is to enable few required APIs. Go to the left sidebar and select API and services. Click enable APIs and services. Then search for maps API. We will have to enable maps SDK for iOS, maps SDK for Android and maps static API. We will have to enable each API one by one. So let's enable static API. So we are here in Google maps platform section. When filtering for maps and finding enabled, you can view all the maps product enabled for your project. All the required products for the uh, project are showing as enabled. The next step is to enable the Blazes API. This API is required if you want to allow users to access location based listings in search results. Go to API and services. Click enabled API and services and search for places api places api and click enable so we have enabled google maps api google places api and static maps api the next api that we need to enable is google play integrity api from the apis and services section click on enable apis and services in the search bar, write Google Play Integrity API and enable. This API helps protect our app from abuse including fake installations and compromised APKs. The next step is to acquire the Maps API key. Go to the left sidebar, API and Services and Credentials. Create a new API key that will be used in your app for accessing the Maps and Places API. Let's copy this key as we will be using this key in various locations of Housey project. Now the next step is to add billing information. From the left sidebar click on billing. It is important to set up billing information for your Google Cloud project. You will only be charged if your project exceeds the free quota. For more information about the costing of Google Maps and the free quota, you can check out the Google Maps platform website mapsplatform.google.com slash pricing. Now is the time to set a Maps API key in the Housey app. Let's switch back to our Housey project in Android Studio. Open the configuration.json file in assets configuration configurations.json and find google maps api key paste the newly created maps api key here we will also need to add this api key in native android and ios projects expand the android directory here expand the app directory here expand the source main res values and strings paste your google maps api key here now for ios expand the ios directory then runner directory and then app delegate dot swift find the gms services dot provide api key 
and update with your own API key. Once everything is set up, it is good practice to download the latest Firebase configuration files. Head over to the Firebase console and open your project and go to the project settings here. Scroll down and download the Google Services.json file for Android and select iOS project and download the Google Services info.playlist. Copy these files and paste in their respective locations. For Android, expand Android directory, expand app directory and replace this file. For iOS, expand iOS directory, expand runner directory and replace this file. With these steps, you have successfully integrated Google Cloud Services into your Housey app. These steps enable Maps, Places API and Play Integrity API for your app. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more tutorials.